Hi guys! Today we are going to do the best friend tag. Um, I've done a friend tag with a lot of different people, but for some reason I've never had Kaz on the video. Well, friend tag. you know. Charming. I know. Um, but there are quite a lot of questions, so we're just going to dive straight in, uh, or it's going to be like a 20 minute video. So, um, first of all, how and when did you meet? Hmm. Well, we're, you're about three years younger than me, aren't you? So, I think we met when you were 16 and I was 19. I believe so. Yeah. And I think the first time we met was at a bus stop. Is that right? That is right. We met at a bus stop. See, I know, because yes. we went out with that twins. sounds wrong. It does sound wrong. Um, yes. We went out with twins, so when people ask how we met, and this is, I know I've got a glow here, this is from the computer, I'm going to like show you a little bit. Um, yeah, when people ask how we met, I'm always like, oh, well, we went out with twins, so that's how we knew each other, because we met through them, but I didn't actually remember how Yeah, you see, I met. knew about you, because you met um, one twin before I met, who I was going out with. Yeah, uh, so you were at the bus stop, and I was just like, ah, oh, I recognise you, and you've been in the other room, in the other bedroom. Oh, I'd been in the other room. Other bedroom, and ah, oh, oh. and that was the first time I met, so there you go. There you go, that's how we met. Yes. Question two, uh, what is your favourite memory together? Hmm. Uh, Could it maybe be when we were trying to get in charisma? <laughs> so, oh my God, I don't know what you're going to say. <laughs> And we couldn't get in because we didn't have ID. <laughs> because and you I lost, never had ID. I lost she my was of age, but she yes. never had ID, and I yeah. wasn't of age. Yeah, I lost my passport when I was out. Yes. Ironically, one night. Yes. So we couldn't get in. So we went round the corner, changed clothes, and then tried to get back in again. Or, oh, actually, we found yes. men to walk back in with, didn't the we? Gay guys. We found a gay yeah. couple um, who we kind of who were much older, like much much older than us. Linked arms with them, had already changed clothes, put our heads down, and walked straight in. <laughs> that was pretty good. Yeah. Yes. That, that might was, be. That might be the best memory. memory. Yes. Definitely. Um, <laughs> there are other ones. <laughs> there are oh, many. I mean, I mean, I'm just following <laughs> the funny one, but I'm, I'm not going to mention it. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously not YouTube appropriate. No. <laughs> um, describe each other in one word. Mm. That's really difficult. Um. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably what most people on YouTube call <sighs> Energetic. <laughs> Confident. <laughs> These aren't one word. These are many words. I'm trying to send you in one word. Hmm. It's like using words in an interview. I know. That's the I'm worst really, question they can really possibly really ask. Hard working. Two words. Um. <laughs> I want to say friendly, but that's like such a cop out. It's like saying nice. Yeah. Yeah. Don't say that. I'm nice. I don't mind, like, yeah. You're alright. I think it's a hard one. To got describe. one. I've got one. Go on. Tolerant. <laughs> Tolerant. <laughs> oh wow, thanks. Tolerant. <laughs> of my craziness. <laughs> you must be tolerant because I have very yeah. few friends left of that age. Well, <laughs> at all. So you must be tolerant. That's the word I'm going with. That's tolerant. like saying punctual. Tolerant. Punctual is great. <laughs> I'm very really intolerant. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot tolerate anyone. Right, okay. Cool. So we can go with tolerant and intolerant. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's good. I like that. Tolerant and intolerant. Oh, we balance that's each cool. other out. That's cool. I like that. Um, what's your dream job? <sighs> dream job. I'm gonna write for a magazine. Mm, write for a magazine. Mm. Um. Getting paid to lie on a beach all day. So you're going to be some kind of model? Yeah, that'd be good. Yeah. Bikini model? Bikini model. Don't have to do a lot of work. That'd Bikini be good. Bikini model. <laughs> um, what is your favourite makeup brand? Ooh. That's actually a really difficult one. Mm, I'd say the, the makeup that I've used the most would be Benefit. Mm. Mm. But I do love, obviously I love Chanel, but... I would say that I've mainly tried benefits. I would say benefit, benefit makeup. I'm gonna go with Revlon. 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 Mm. They have the things that I can't live without. Oh, mainly Revlon Colour Stay. That's always good. I think if I had to pick one thing, you have to you have to stay with the foundation that you absolutely love, and that would be Revlon mm. Colour Stay for me. So Revlon. Yeah. Oh, okay. What is something that annoys you about the other person? <laughs> 
Sloan's been angled all day. Like, sunbeds! <laughs> I don't go on the sunbed anymore. No, but when I'm she did, sunbed. that's probably the thing that annoys her about me. That I'm like, stop going on the sunbed! Yeah, so I'd say that you tell, try and tell me what you to say do. Bossy. It's the bossy. Way. Bossy, yes. You used to say, yeah. I was brutally honest. Yeah. You're this still, is the case. Still brutally honest. If you <laughs> ask me, like, you know, should I be going on the sunbeds? No, you shouldn't be going on the sunbeds! And there's nothing wrong with being brutally honest. No, with the right person. Yes. <laughs> don't just go about your life being really brutally honest with everyone because people don't like that. Um, if you could go anywhere in the world together, where would it be? And why? <gasps> New York. New York, yes. Because Without a doubt. Shopping. of the shopaholic books. Yes, definitely. New I love the shopaholic books. They're amazing. It'll happen at some point. Oh. Fake comedy or a chick flick? No, we're at number eight. Where are you? Oh, I was just randomly picking. Wait, for, you can't just... Pick the question, then we're going in order. <laughs> Favourite inside joke? Have we got an inside joke? Hmm. I don't think we have, have we? There might be things that we would say that would remind us of something. You know, like if you've both watched something or... Yeah, oh, like with the cough, with the... Exactly, that's the... exactly what I was thinking of, that's yeah. so strange. It's not with a joke. Yeah. Like, in the shopaholic books, she makes the, like, the references to try and save money and she buys the big coffee machine. If you've, not in the actual, does she do this in the film? I don't know, the film was rubbish compared yeah, to the books. Yeah, the film was, was fine on its own, but it's not the books. And um, to save money on the coffees that she's buying all the time, she buys this really expensive coffee machine. That's like, we've basically both done that. Yeah, <laughs> we have definitely both done that. Um, and I still buy five <laughs> costas at least a week. <laughs> and yeah, I've, I don't use it. Well, I've, I've got a flask at work, and you never ever use never it. Never used. And that's brilliant. But yeah, that's that's what, whenever we're trying to like justify spending something or saving money or whatever, that's always the analogy it's that we come be back the to. Coffee maker, definitely. Um, who takes longer to get ready in the morning? Hmm. I'm gonna go for you. Really? Because I could be ready really quick. I can as well, though. Well, maybe we've just like. We're both just, you know, we're not as maintenance. Once upon a time, you had to wash your hair and blow dry it every yeah, single yes. morning. And that doesn't happen Every anymore. day. Yeah, it doesn't happen anymore. Dry shampoo all the way. Every yes. day, I every swear. Day. I just I couldn't know. get my head around it. I would just scrape hair my hair up. No, in it. because it got, it was so, because my hair's so thin, it got really greasy if I didn't wash it every day. But now, I The invention think. of dry shampoo, it saves lives. Yeah. It saves lives. It does. Um, and because I didn't think my hair suit would be up, so. Now I'm just like, yeah, whatever. Jeez, if you can't put your hair up, that would drive yeah. me insane. Favourite season? Ooh. Autumn. I, yeah. Mm, I think spring for me. I think spring's my favourite. Really? Yeah. 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 Interesting. Hmm. Favourite song? Favourite song? Hmm. What's your favourite song? I don't know. It changes mm. all the time. At the moment, I really like, um, I like it so much, I can't remember her name. Uh, <laughs> Casey, Casey Musgrave or something. Mm. She's like a country singer. I really like her, and I like Follow Your Arrow from that. But I have like mm, a song that I will listen to all the time, all the time, all the time. Yeah, and then I move and then, on. Yeah, you always like, come back to songs that you love. But yeah, I used to absolutely love Celine Dion. Think, think twice, Celine Dion. Oh, anything, like anything Celine, Celine Dion. Classic stuff though. Yeah, the real like karaoke songs. Yeah, I really like it in the minute. Probably Christina Perry, Thousand Years. What you used to. Whitney Houston, yes. Greatest love of all. Yeah. And Run To You. Mm. Mm. It's There's so many. Difficult. I don't think you can actually pick no. one. I can't pick one favourite yeah, song. I couldn't pick just one. No. no. However, I will say, um, our wedding song was the Beatles' Here, There and Everywhere. Mm. Which was the song that Phoebe had on the steel drums when she got married in Friends. So mm. I'll just put that out there as a favourite-ish. Yeah. Because I really like that one. Yeah. So. Cool. Uh, number 12, what is it, so this is a question for you, <laughs> what is it like being best friends with someone who is obsessed with YouTube? <clears throat> well, I think when you started doing it, I didn't really realise... Did you get it? I, I didn't really get it. And I now, think obviously... when I first started YouTube, it affected our friendship in that it was all I used to talk about and if you don't get it and you're not like involved in it, yeah. then it kind of... You end up being a muggle. Exactly, it's what I like to call, I like to call Kaz a muggle. When yes. we go to things where there are other bloggers or a blogging event and I take Kaz with me, she is a muggle because yes. she is a non-blogging folk. Yes, and I can, I'm introduced as this. So. She is a muggle. Yes, <laughs> and when you get really excited about meeting somebody, I'll say, oh, who is that? Like, oh my God, it's Miss Lamarazzi. She was like, 
was like, all right. Who um, um, was about? I have no idea. What? Well, <laughs> yeah. I know. That's just like from my perspective. I think that yeah. it can. If, 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 if you don't want, if you don't appreciate what has been done, mm. and, and I, I think it's, I think it's great. I think that it's just a great, it's a great way of. Keep running out of space on memory cards, so I don't know where we got up to. But moving on, um, heels or flats? Ooh, it depends on the occasion. I would say so too. Yes. Flats normally, yeah. But I do like a little heel. Yes, I would do <clears> a <throat> heel at night, but during the day, flats all the way. I like flat boots, especially. Mm. Like we both flat boots. You know, not tall. Yes. But don't have a problem with it. <laughs> so I'm quite happy to be <laughs> short. I'm happy to wear flat shoes when we go out. Yeah, but I feel more dressed mm. up. In heels. Yeah, I yeah, I feel like mm. I can dance more better flats. in heels. No, see, for me, I feel more dressed. If you up go straight in and dance, dress, so but if you've dance. been on heels, if you've been like in heels yeah. all day, then you're like, oh, oh, oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> I think dressy up boots that are flat. Are good. <coughs> Definitely. Um, pants or dresses? The so trousers or dresses? Um, I'm gonna say I really like dresses that are fitted here and then floaty. It's like your skater style. You're definitely more of a dress person. Uh, yeah, definitely. We would be like the feminine and the masculine in the relationship. I would wear, I mean, just like what we're wearing right now, like... Girly? It goes with the tree. It goes with the tree. It goes with the tree. Black and dark and grey. <laughs> so like... I hate the world the kind of thing. Yeah, basically that's, yeah. that's how it goes, yeah. I've just seen one of the questions, it's quite funny. We'll see it in a minute. Um, mm, mm, favourite animal? <gasps> dog? Dog for me. I've got three dogs, so... You don't know any other animals. Yeah. And no dogs. If your house was burning down and your entire family was sure to be okay, what would you save and why? <laughs> my Kate's feed bag. <laughs> <laughs> and then my phone, maybe. You, you've got it, it's got to be your... My computer. Your computer. Computer yes. um, and camera and any memory cards that I could hold. Yes. Everything else you can repurchase. Yeah. It's the, like the bag. Insurance pays for that stuff and mm. it's the things that you can't replace like pictures and videos and yeah. that oh, stuff. Yeah. I'm such a bad person. I've not seen photos, aren't I? <laughs> <laughs> no. Is it Kate's fake bag first? Pic but pictures, like... People put pictures online and things now. Um, yeah. But it's like, yeah, I would take my computer. Um, comedy, horror, or chick flick? Chick flick, mm. maybe comedy. Mm. You see, all three for me, but chick flick probably the most. Mm. Love a chick flick. Chick flick. Whereas Kaz will watch flick. horror yeah, all day long, horror. and I will not have any part of that. I like being scared. That's crazy! <laughs> Why would you like to be scared? I don't know, as long as I've got someone to sleep with that night, I'm <laughs> cool with You, pussy. <laughs> Blackberry or iPhone? iPhone. iPhone. All the way. I used to have a Blackberry. I actually really didn't want to move to an iPhone. I did it because of the picture quality. Mm. And yes. now I cannot be without my iPhone. Yeah. I loved the Blackberry keys though. The actual texting on a Blackberry was amazing. Yeah. Well, in fairness, I've never had a Blackberry, so it's hard for me to judge. But mm. I would say, in terms of the look of them, I prefer iPhone. Yes. Yeah. Um, Favourite movie? Mm. Sleepless in Seattle. I think Runaway Bride. It's a good one. It's a good one. Oh, my best friend's wedding. All mm. the Julia Roberts ones. Yeah. They're all good. Um, what is something weird that you eat? Is this <laughs> both of us or each of us? You, what do you I eat like weird? I like to eat a pot noodle and a Snickers at the same time. <laughs> it's sweet. Andy was saying that the other day. Like, surely you don't eat. You I don't dip, dip it in. No. I'll have a bit of my pot noodle and a Drink of my tea and then have a bit of my chocolate. And pot noodle and tea noodle. is weird enough. Yeah. Pot noodle see, and like pop or something. I you would start eat. eating normally if I was pregnant. Yeah. <laughs> Without a doubt. Pot noodle and Snickers is so weird. Um, um, I don't know. What do I eat? I don't know. I like pickled gherkins, you know the little ones? I always liked those, but when I was pregnant with Ella, I was eating like a jar a day. And people thought, oh, it's a weird pregnancy craving. But I always liked miniature pickled gherkins. If they're in the fridge right now, I'd eat them. So, some people don't like those, I suppose that's a bit weird. Um, do you guys have anything matching? Oh, yay! Matching watches! Watches that we're wearing right now! Yes. So yes, we do have matching things. We do have, I mean, our Kate Spade 
purses are kind of matching. Yeah, that's true. Um, they are. Yeah. You, oh, got, you both had that got bracelet. Um, Shambhala bracelet. Yes, yes. We both got the same bracelet. Uh, we probably have like some yeah. items of clothing. Mm, yes, maybe. Mm. Not the same. But they're, you know, yeah. they're things that come yeah. to mind. And lastly, what is your favourite TV show? I probably, um, I love watching like The Office, the British one. Mm. I really love that. Royal Family. Hmm, English I, stuff. This English is where stuff. this is where this is the divide. Oh, no, American. I'm I'm very much an American TV person. Not yes. down with the British comedy. <laughs> I love I love ugh. Friends. I love all that. But there's some I don't know. There's some mm. British comedies that I think are really up there. I don't know. Some, there's some okay ones. I like them. It's just they wouldn't be my favourites. I would watch them mm. like Dinner Ladies, Victoria Wood. I absolutely love. Mm. But I wouldn't choose to watch it over. Yeah. Something else. Something Love um, Friends, 30 Rock and Parks and Recreations are probably my top three. I'm um, trying to get me into the Parks I'm and Recreations. I'm trying so hard yes. to get her into it. Aziz Ansari is like the funniest guy. Amy Poehler. Yeah. It's just hilarious. <laughs> Amy Poehler, in fact there we have like Amy Poehler and um, Tina Fey who were like best friends and they kind of headlined the two shows so yeah I absolutely I, love American I am stuff. getting into that. Like, I have watched a few now and I'm like, I'm, I'm sort of warm into it now. I, but I, I have to give, I have to to give things it. a chance and it's hard to like let something new in. It is hard to let something new yeah, in. It's it difficult to let things in. It is. Um, but that's it. That, that's the entire friend tag. I thought that would take us ages. Uh, we did have some technical difficulties but other than that, um, it, it was okay. And we've nearly lost the light completely. I thought we were going to film yeah. some more things but... I believe it's getting dark already. It's pretty much dark outside so apart from this glow on my chin. Um, we're losing the light completely and Milo is asleep upstairs so I'm not sure if we can be quiet enough to go upstairs and use the light box so that might be it for our videos today but uh, I hope you enjoyed this the questions will be below because I couldn't find the questions for like half an hour because hardly anybody puts them in the info bar but I will definitely put them down there if you want to do this video and uh, if you want to see Kaz in more videos give it a thumbs up and leave a comment below and I will see you guys in my next one bye, bye.